a rare tornado touches down in Cape Cod, Mass. Take a look at this video. You can see the wind and rain pick up when the strong winds rip the roof off of a hotel. You can see from the aerial video the storm uprooted trees and scattered debris all over. At one point, 90% of residents were without power, and officials are warning it could be days before it's fully restored. The damage from the storm has caused the town to declare a state of emergency. Wow. Just wild wow video in the first place, right. but you rarely hear about Cape Cod and tornadoes. Mm -hmm. That's just something that really doesn't match yeah. up. And that's because the waters up to the north mm -hmm. are warm or cooler than what you have down right. in the south. Not to say cold waters are going to protect you from tornadoes, right. but they don't enforce it or right. get things moving right. as fast. And this was actually Cape Cod's second tornado warning within two days. This is very rare, but you can guess why. It was the heat wave. Sometimes we forget we live in our little bubble thinking, oh, Virginia was the only one on fire. Actually, it was up and down the East Coast. You see this rain that cooled everyone off as well. So some really nice cooler areas back in place. But goodness, our hearts go out to them. That was a lot of damage and they're not used to that type weather. We've got some clouds still in place. They are very thin, but making for a beautiful sunrise as we start off the morning. Current temperature 67 degrees. Your winds are now beginning to shift more out of the north and I look for them to stay that way throughout the day. Now, as far as your dew points, I know we always talk a lot about those in the summertime. When they're in the 70s, it's miserable, it is unbearable, it is swampy. Mid 60s, it's still humid. We're still in Virginia, it's still the south as well as summer. So it's gonna feel dramatically different because of what we've been experiencing, but it's still going to be one of those days you've got to hydrate. You've got to be smart about being outdoors in sweet summertime. 63 right now on the Wiesa, 64 in the Tri-Cities. You've got 67 in West Point. Lunchtime will be in the upper 70s. That is the most comfortable lunch we have had in a very long time. Yesterday was cool, but it was wet, soggy everywhere. A slim chance for showers that would simply pop up and move out in a snap. I'll have more details and when we'll see more rain coming up.